how to balance this reaction zinc plus nitric acid that producing nitrate nitrogen plus water so in the right hand side the number of zinc is one and this two is common for every atom in this parenthesis so here we have two nitrogen then here we have oxygen a suffix three times two that is six here we have two more nitrogen then here we have two hydrogen then here we have one oxygen so basically we have four nitrogen and seven oxygen so look this nitrogen and oxygen is present in more than one compound so we'll try to that we'll try to balance that atom first that is present in single compound here hydrogen two here one so to balance just you have to multiply by something that something gives you two and this if you multiply by something that something must come before the atom this here this hydrogen come from here so you have to place here two and if you place here two the number of hydrogen is two the number of nitrogen will be two the number of oxygen will be two times three six now try to balance uh, nitrogen here yeah, here two here four simply multiply here by two that gives you four this two must come before this nitrogen that is here so two times two that gives you four right if you place here four the number of hydrogen will be four the number of nitrogen will be four the number of oxygen will be four times three twelve now check here hydrogen to four so let us balance hydrogen for this two must come before this hydrogen that is here so four hydrogen and two oxygen so change here so now you have eight oxygen four 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 now balance oxygen here 12 here eight but you need here uh, 12 right you need here 12 so you can change okay look here you have eight but you need 12 so these two oxygen has come from here so multiply here by something that gives you 12 look if you multiply here look six and you need here also six right so multiply here by three six times uh, plus two times th three that gives you look 12 6 plus 6 so if you multiply here by something that something must come before the atom so this oxygen has come from here so 2 times 3 that is 6 so we have 12 uh, hydrogen now and 6 oxygen already we have written totally we have 12 now balance hydrogen here 12 here 4 so multiply here by 3 that gives you 12 this 3 must come before this hydrogen that is here so 4 times 3 12 so now you have 12 hydrogen then 12 nitrogen and 30 12 times 3 36 oxygen now balance look here nitrogen 12 here 4 here oxygen 36 here 12 so you you need to uh, balance nitrogen and oxygen look here the number of nitrogen and oxygen is more but here less so in this compound you will get more nitrogen and oxygen so we'll work on this compound so look nitrogen here 12 here 4 so to balance nitrogen what you can do look this nitrogen has come from here so if you you need here 12 right so if you change here look if you if you multiply here by 5 2 times 5 10 plus 2 that is 12 right okay 2 times 5 plus 2 12 so 
if you multiply by something that something must come before the nitrogen atom so this nitrogen atom has come from here so place here five so now you are getting five zinc then five here two these two is common two times five ten nitrogen here two times five ten nitrogen plus two nitrogen that is twelve nitrogen then oxygen here is six three times two six six plus six times five that is six times five means thirty thirty plus two times three six that is thirty six here and here zinc is one so to balance zinc multiply here by five that gives you five this five must come before this atom that is here so look five five twelve twelve 12 12 then 36 36 everything is balanced so you can say that this is the balanced chemical equation